guys, it is me. I am back and I have missed you all dearly. I wanted to come back and talk to you guys and do some more vlogs. I kind of got everything set up so that I am able to do a really high quality vlog for you. So I hope you enjoy this new system we have going on and let's talk about some new fall makeup products that I am loving. Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm so ready. Empty window. And only half the lights are out. Getting right into it, I wanted to talk about a few things. One is the new berry lip trend that we have going on. I actually have all the colors ready to go and swatched on my hand for you. I have one of them on my lips as well. This is a Bare Minerals. It's called Live Large. It's one of the lip colors from their Moxie collection. <clears throat> this one is probably one of my favorites and I really have no complaints when it comes to Berry Minerals. I love their stuff. Everybody knows it and so of course I had to get a berry from them. I really like the deep rich color of it as well. I feel like it goes really great with my skin tone and I can wear it with like a little darker eye or I could just wear it by itself with like a more simple eye with some lashes. So there's a million possibilities with it. But there's more. So this color right here is also a Berry Minerals. This is a lip gloss. Let's see if I can Whoa, buddy. You may not be able to see these, so I'll have to take pictures for you. But this is a gloss. This is also from their Moxie collection, and it is called Dare Devil. I hope you guys can see it. The color next to that gloss, the one right here, is by Revlon. This is a drugstore. And, oh, I'm sorry. It is a Maybelline Color Sensational. This color is Mauve It Up. And it's from their Color Sensational line. It's just a lighter, more sheer um, berry color. Then this color right here that is super sheer, it has some berry kind of flex in it. I use this over a lot of other colors to kind of turn it into a nice, sheer, just pretty, like, iridescent glow. This is also a Revlon. It's one of those uh, lip butters from the Color Burst collection. And this is one of the ones that was in the... Um, like project runway tubes or whatnot. It's like super purple in the tube, obviously, but it's more like, oh, it's more sheer and um, just like kind of gives like a nice iridescent glow. This one is called Provocative. Then I have this super, super deep, rich, like really dark berry color. This is a buxom color and it is called Menace. So this also, I think, goes good on different colored skin tones, um, or deeper skin tones, or lighter skin tones, and I can pull it off, So, and I'm pretty fair, so I feel like a lot of people can pull that color off. So those are my picks for the berry lip trend that's going on right now. I'm sure there's more. If you guys have any that you like, comment below and let me know what you have been loving, because I'm super ready for some deep, deep fall lips. Next up. Uh, Bare Minerals again. This is like my top pick for palettes right now. This is called the Perfect 10 or the Big 10. I don't remember the name. I'll link it below in the video response area description whatnot. You know what I'm talking about. So this is everything in the palette, okay? <clears throat> it also comes with some brushes that I took out and one of them I lost. Surprise, surprise. So, um, <laughs> the one, it came with a lip palette and then this, like, dual-ended, like, face palette. But you get six eyeshadows, a highlight color, and a blush, and then these two are lip colors. I haven't used those yet, but I've used everything else. In fact, this is all what I have on my face today. I have a bunch of these colors, and then I use the highlight and the blush on my face as well. And I really, really, really like it. I like the consistency, the shadows. I'm a big Bare Minerals fan to begin with, um, mostly because it's just really quality, quality stuff. It is a tad bit more than, you know, your regular drugstore items, but it's definitely not as much as some of those high-priced, high-end, like, other brands that are out there, and Bare Minerals to me is one of the top five when it comes to quality in brands. So I like that palette. I'm liking all those eyeshadow colors, and I really, really like the blush that's in there as well. Next up, I have this new scent that I like, and you guys are going to be surprised because it's a Kim Kardashian one, and I didn't really, I would never kind of fell into that whole like Kardashian craze. I do watch the show. Who doesn't? 
I guess there's a lot of people who don't, but this is the new one. It smells like honey. So I kind of thought it would be a little bit cheaper um, than that Marc Jacobs honey one that was out. And I haven't been able to compare the scents or whatnot, but this does literally legitimately smell like musk and honey. Like this is a super, super honey smell. I really like it. I feel like um, if you're not into sweet or musky scents, you probably won't like this. Um, it is really sweet and it's really musky and it literally smells like straight up honey. So it is the K, it's the Kim Kardashian and it's called Pure Honey. So check that one out. Last but not least, I know we're going kind of fast here, but I don't want to bombard you guys with a bunch of stuff since I just got back to filming and everything. So um, I wanted to kind of keep this down to a low roar when it comes to the new um, fall trends that I'm loving. There's going to be a series of articles, obviously, that go along with this because there's a lot of stuff for fall, but... One of the things I'm really liking for fall is a brand new brand that I just found out about it. They have been around for a while, but I, it's new to me. So it's called Bella Terra Mineral Cosmetics. They have these amazing nine stacks. They're like little mini eyeshadow palettes, but they're loose pigments. And they're smaller, like, for storage space, which I like. And the colors are out of this world. I got the 9 stack in Emerald Shimmer Powder. Then I have uh, Diamond. They're all shimmery. They're mineral, loose pigments, and they're all shimmery. There's not, like, any matte colors in these. So if you like a matte eye, you probably won't like these. But um, if you really like... Um, shimmer and stuff like gemstones to me and I really I have created so many eye looks with these so far um, and I'm gonna link it all below but this is a really good alternative to different um, pigments that are out there I know that Mac has some loose pigments um, you know everybody pretty much makes look pi loose pigments nowadays but I've never seen any that come in these like stackable and super fun colors like this. So um, definitely check that out. It's Bellaterra Cosmetics, Bellaterra Mineral Cosmetics. And I don't think you guys will be disappointed in the quality of these. I know I am loving them. I'm going to have an official review coming up um, on, the whole, on the whole brand because I got a, a bunch of stuff from them that I'm really, really, really loving. So um, <clears throat> stay tuned for that. But they were included in my fall favorites because I have been using them a lot this fall. Another thing that I've been really liking is the Jonathan products. Um, it is 100% uh, all natural product. It's all vegan. It's like paraben free, chemical free, everything free. And I use it like a dry shampoo to like touch up my roots, but it's actually a color. Um, it's like an all-natural color ingredient. It's called Root Touch-Up. So it's a powder. You just kind of like take it and it comes in like a little brush like this. And you just take it and you literally like brush it into your like onto your head. You can do whatever you feel like you may need a little bit of a root touch-up because your color is starting to show through. Um, this has been really cool. I think it makes my hair look thicker, which I really, really, really like. <laughs> but I've actually been using it as a dry shampoo, not necessarily a root touch-up because I haven't been coloring my hair. But... Um, I really like it. So that is it for today. I don't want to bombard you guys with a ton of stuff, but I did want to say hi and make a little video and tell you all the wonderful things that have been happening. So stay tuned. There's going to be some changes, um, even more than have already been happening. So I missed you guys. I hope everyone is good, and I hope you're all having a wonderful fall. Bye.